I thought the timing of me talking to you today was really good because, um, you know, they announced something about a Netflix series called Sandman uh, or my mistake. What? Do you know about it? Have you heard? <laughs> Are you a fan of Neil, Neil Gaiman? Well, I mean, listen, I don't want to get you in any trouble because I know that everything is, you know, I'm not going to ask. Uh, I guess I, no, I wish I had some sunglasses, man. Um, <laughs> fuck, I had some somewhere. No, these are my Logan sunglasses. Um, yeah, I, yeah, man, we're doing it. Uh, we're doing the Sandman. We're shooting it out in London. And um, I play the Corinthian, which uh, is one of the, uh, yeah, coolest thing that's happened uh, in a while to me uh, to get to play this character because I, there's just, um, yeah, it's one of the good ones that hasn't been done. And um, it's like the last comp, it's like the one of the best comic books that haven't been made. So it's, um, it's exciting. Making it now is the perfect time because of the mixture of the audience ability to understand all this the visual effects being what they are and having something like ne somebody like Netflix who is willing to tell this story in an adult way. Um, and so I guess what I want to know is uh, how did you get the role? Was it something you went after? Like talk a little bit about how you got involved. It was a long process. Uh, I had heard that they were doing it. I heard, I mean, I've, I've heard over the years people were doing it, you know, I think, Joseph Gordon-Levitt was even going to try to do something, and that would have been, I would have loved to see his version. Um, uh, but I read the script, and they're really adamant about everyone auditioning. So I, I went in, I can't remember. It must have been like a year ago, probably. A year ago, and then, and then, I didn't hear anything for until probably like, uh, man, September or something like that. Anyways, a long process. And then they, uh, the conversation just started. Um, and then they wanted to, to tape again and they wanted to uh, meet with Neil, which I was really interested in doing and talking just how the show was going to be done. I had some, you know, I, just because a project gets greenlit, you know, doesn't doesn't mean things are going to go great. Uh, you kind of want to suss out and figure out who, who's involved and how are you going to do things and what's the approach um, and to make sure everything lines up and makes sense to 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 do because you 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 know you want to Neil has it done done this for thirty years so you don't want to you know, lead with the wrong foot. You want to get the ship in the water and point it in the right direction from the get-go. Because again, that's, that's something really hard to reverse engineer. So yeah, I'm really excited. We um, just started on London and we've got uh, incredible actors to work with and to portray these characters. When did, so you just started filming recently? Yeah, just before Christmas. I'll be there until uh, June. Is this one of these things when you sign on that they say to you, we have a three season idea. We have a five season idea. We, you, we want you to know what we're doing before you sign on, because this is not something that I envision is going to fail. I envision this being a, a flagship on Netflix, like something big. So yeah. how much are they telling you when you sign on? Just know we have a five season plan. Yeah, I think everyone wants... Uh, show to continue. I think that's a standard contract. I think seven, five years, whatever. Um, we have talked about all that. Um, I don't know if it'll work out. I think it might work out in, in different blocks uh, of time. But um, yeah, you definitely want to hear how, you know, how long something's going to have. You want to have some sort of macro idea of like how some how long something's gonna last but um yeah i can't i don't really want to give away the details of how long completely the i guess what i want to know is uh you've obviously read the scripts and i'm curious oh. <laughs> okay so you you've read at least once no i read them yeah 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 i was gonna say but like for fans of the material 
and obviously you're familiar with the material now that you've signed on. What do you think for fans, what can they look forward to? Dave Goyer's on it. Alan Heinberg is our showrunner. Um, these guys know what they're doing. Um, our our uh, directors, Jamie Child, um, and um, our other director, huh, I'm totally blanking on right now. He's going to kill me. Um, but yeah, these guys are smart and, and, and they're artists and they're craftsmen. So um, I think no one's leaving any stone and turned on how, on what stories to incorporate and how to weave them in together and, and how to play this, um, um, you know, storyline through. Um, I think what people are just going to see this thing uh, realized is, is, is transforming it is, is really what it's all about, you know, making it, it is a hard show to, to turn into reality you know there's so much set building and there's so much uh, design that goes into this um so a lot of people are employed to to get that done so um and with such grandiose sort of sets and all that stuff you have to have a lot of people making you know and uh, coming to an agreement on decision 